Hey folks, so good morning. It is Wednesday morning. I just got out of the gym as you can see behind me. And today should be an interesting day. Um, but I'll tell you more about it when I get to the car. Yes, today is vlog number 50. Five zero. Wow, I can't believe I've done 50 of these already. That's incredible. I was actually contemplating doing a montage of the last 50 videos and putting it into one, but I decided to leave it for 100. Today, it, oh, it is early too. It's about 7.30 a.m. Today, I have a lunch meeting and then uh, tonight there's a hockey game. So, yeah, it's going to be a pretty active day. So I'm going to try to catch as much of the of the coverage as I can. As you guys have come to know by now, I don't do them every single day. Um, unless I had something going on. Like if I was off for a whole week and I had stuff planned every day, I'd probably do a vlog every day. Because I would have the time to do it. Um, but, you know, during the week, I really don't have much time to do the editing and everything. And also, I don't have anything interesting to video so I, I don't want these to be very mon you know mundane and blah you know I want something a little different every time or every other time or something so which is why I'm saying you know today's a little different so I'll, I'll catch some footage of today uh, and tonight for the game of course weather really warmed up like I know I've been whining about cold in the last couple of vlogs especially the last two but wow, what a difference, let me tell you. They're expecting another mid-80 day today. Coffee. Hey guys, so as you can see, I'm uh, a little more dressed. Um, I'm off to my uh, work lunch, so come along. Hi there, so I'm on my way. Welcome to Highway 1 and 9. This is the intersection. This is the end of the 3. And that freaking botcher truck is going to probably be in front of me all the way, which I hate. I don't like having trucks in front of me or on the side of me. It's very hard to see what's in front of you. I think it's a hazard. Uh, but they are in the right lane, which is the law. They can't be in the left. What's really irritating is when they're both in the left and the right lane, because then you can't escape them even if you want it. So, yeah. So this part of the journey is actually not very long, but it takes long because of all of the trucks and all of the traffic lights and all of the congestion. Hi again. Yes, I'm still in traffic. It is 11.25 and apparently I have seven tenths of a mile to go before I get to the circle. I can actually, I, I know where I am, so I'm almost at the circle. Yeah, the circle is the worst part of this and that's why it's there's a delay. It's not there's an accident, there's not construction. Well, there might be, but I doubt that's what it is. It's really all that congestion up at the circle. That's, that's what it is. Oh, apparently there is construction work area ahead. Haha. <laughs> okay. So, you see that white truck? It's not that white truck, but there was a, um, in front of it, there's a slow moving operated truck. Oh, they, they did, oh, they did. 
did enhance this. That he was the delay. That truck was what the delay was. That's just crazy. This circle a little bit. Actually, not quite so bad. Here. Hi. So I am. Um, at the mouth of the Holland Tunnel almost, but you guys can't see that because there's an American Trading House truck in front of me, www.ashimport.com, um, but not a plug for them. I don't know who they are. It's just a random truck that's in front of me. <laughs> um, but yeah, so if this truck wasn't there, you guys would be able to see the big Holland Tunnel sign. Um, I would actually have see see the big sign Holland Tunnel. <laughs> oh, I know. So now I am in the, the heart of Jersey City. folks it's like a little it's like a little park like in the corner here it's really nice this area I've never been down here well I probably have been down here just not as it was developed my co-worker is only a few minutes away so I figured I'd just wait so we can go together Apparently that's the sugar house. <laughs> it's an absolutely gorgeous day. So uh, the uh, work lunch was really informative, really in in interesting. I'm actually looking forward to uh, hearing a little bit more of what the, the uh, vendor has to offer us. But uh, I'm just walking to my car so I can go home. Work for a couple hours and I'm to the hockey game. So fun, fun, fun.
So, yeah, I did make it home. Um, it was less delay than it was when I got there. It was about 10 minutes. Um, and that was because there was a lane closed. Um, because it, it, they're building, like, a new on-ramp. So that whole lane was closed for a little bit. And then by then it opened up. And... Hey there. Uh, so I'm off to the hockey game. Um, I actually hadn't realized it was not until 7.30. Not 7.00. So, I actually had a little time. I had half an hour, but yeah. Is the uh, Devils and the Bruins. Um, and I did sell my second seat again. Um, actually, I've sold the last few, which is pretty good. Um, considering. Oh, uh, on interesting news, I don't think I updated you guys on this. Um, I know some of you have been asking about it, but I know I rambled on about the. Um, Devil's not charging me for the uh, renewal as of yet. Well, I got a lovely phone call from the representative. She left a voice message because I was actually, um, I was actually uh, almost home and I couldn't really have the conversation. But they um, they finally processed and charged my my renewal. The Devils goal scored by number 26, Patrick Elena. His 11th of the season, assisted by number 15, Steve Solomon.
Last minute of play in the third period. see me it's very dark it is 11 27 p.m. and I am just arriving home now um, the game ended a little after 10 the horrendous horrendous horrible game ended at or after 10 we had somewhat of a little comeback at the end but it just was the same pathetic play that we've been seeing lately um, that might be a little better. Um, but suffice it to say, um, after the game was over, we had a monsoon of a rain and thunderstorm. Like, it was pouring buckets, so everybody kind of stu stood in the uh, vestibule of the uh, arena until it, you know, lightened up a little bit, and then we ran to the car. And then... It was like 20 minutes to get out of the parking lot, another 25 minutes to actually get on the highway and get out of Newark. It was just not pleasant. I wanted to end the vlog now because I know when I get in, I'm just going to go right to bed. I need to get up early. So don't forget to like and share and comment. We'll see you guys in the next video.